So the Santa suit is about a young woman. Her name is Ivy Perkins. And she's gone through kind of a sad divorce. And on a whim, she decides she needs to reinvent herself. She needs to pull up her roots in Atlanta. And she needs to move to a new house in a new state. And she is fixated on old white farmhouses. So she finds a house online. It's called Four Roses Farm. She buys it sight unseen. And she packs up her, her dog and her, her belongings and moves to the mountains of North Carolina and arrives the week before Christmas. And the house is not quite what she'd pictured. It's old and it's kind of dilapidated. Um, and um, the when she pulls up to the house, there is a guy standing there and she's, you know, a stranger. And she's says, can I help you? And he says, well, I'm, I'm Ezra, your real estate agent. I'm here to give you the keys. And of course, when she bought the house online, she pictured an Ezra as, you know, an elderly gentleman with a bow tie and a sweater vest. <laughs> and this Ezra has neither of those attributes. <laughs> and um, so when she goes in the house, she's shocked to find that it's, it's been left furnished with the um, previous elderly owner's belongings none of which are Ivy's taste and, and including the clothes in the closet. So she's pulling the things out of the closet so she can put her own things in. And on the shelf, she finds a, a beautifully wrapped box with Christmas paper and she opens it up and she finds a vintage, beautifully made red velvet Santa suit. Mm. And um, at that point, Ezra tells her that the previous owners, Bob and Betty Ray Rose were the, Mr. and Mrs. Santa Claus for the community. And for 40 years, they decorated their house, you know, to the max every year at Christmas. And people came from miles around to see Four Roses Farm lit up for Christmas. And then Bob and Betty Ray were Mr. and Mrs. Santa. And this is Santa Bob's costume. And so she's, she's like, eh, she's not really interested in Christmas this year. She, her plan is just to, you know, kind of huddle down and get over get through Christmas so she can start her new life. But that night when she's going to put the um, Santa suit back in the closet, she finds a note in the pocket in a child's handwriting. And it says, dear Santa, my mommy is sad all the time. All I want for Christmas is for you to bring my daddy home from the war. Wow. And that sends Ivy into a quest to find out um, who Carlette was did her daddy come home from the war? And why did Santa Claus keep this note? And so the house is full of the clues to that secret. And there's, of course, some romance and, of course, a little bit of mystery. But I just, you know, I wanted to write a story, as Debbie said, that's a gift to my readers. 